All right, we're starting to establish a spectrum here. At the very lowest, we have the Net Gator. Slightly above that, my current T-shirt. Above that, we have my back of the pocket ratty has to be reused. I thought you threw that away. Never. I'm, still... gonna, I'm gonna keep it, it's my binky. And then above that, we have KN95. And of course, the gold standard is armless. That's that's always gonna be the lesson, hopefully. Uh, but I made the joke about a pillowcase and you have a freaking pillowcase. Yeah. Here's my question to you. Where do you think this lands on the spectrum. I think this is in that gator territory. I, I bet it's better. Well, I'm, are we doing one ply or two? Well, I think so. When the CDC was telling people at the beginning, make your own mask, yeah. they actually said like a sheet and they said to do two layers. So I think we should do it as intended, which is just throw two that layers? in there. Yeah, yeah. I, think, I think that's going to do much better than the, the minion, The minion pillowcase. This is literally taking off my kid's bed. <laughs> like this morning. My kid's gonna come back and he's gonna be like, where's my pillowcase? I'm like, You're like I put well, salt in it. The good news is I assaulted your pillow. Your pillow. Is a star. That's correct. So we're just gonna lay it just like that, and that's gonna be the two the two layers. Yep. Lock it. Way easier than KN95 to apply and let's see what happens. I like the fact that we're starting to get a leaderboard that we can keep going back to. Yeah, yeah. Like if it's we're at 22%. Yeah! <laughs> so far. <laughs> 25, it's climbing. Nice. The pillowcase mask is climbing. Uh, the airflow resistance, which you haven't really talked much about here, um, is actually pretty high though. Well, so, and, and that is the reason people wear those neck gaiters is because they're, really if, if they're not really thinking about filtration, they're thinking about comfort yeah. because it's basically pantyhose that you're breathing through. That's right. I wouldn't recommend trying to breathe through this necessarily, um, but the efficiency is looking good. You know, 19.9% looks like it's holding steady right around there. On the filtration. Now, yeah. uh, does it measure, I, we didn't even ask about the, does it measure how hard it is to breathe through? Or? That's what the airflow resistance is, yeah. So that's that that would be that number. This machine, it, they're throwing, that, that's not the purpose of this machine. There's actually a separate machine that would be better at uh, measuring it's that. How yeah. It now, and it is actually, it's worth noting that the, the FDA actually has standards for how breathable your mask has to be. Mm -hmm. um, and obviously the, the thicker or the, the more efficient it is, the, the less breathable it can be. Um, but also we are testing this at like a max amount, as I pointed out before, uh, it's at a rate right of around 88, uh, 85 liters a minute, which that's is like that's like you doing those right. deep breaths, like a yoga breath would probably be around like 20 or 30 liters per minute. All right, what do we come in at? 17.5 percent. That's two gators. Well, and I guess if I'm being charitable, right? I guess this is kind of like it is two sheets. Yeah. So it is kind of like two gators. Yeah. yeah. It's basically it's a gator. Yeah. Yeah but a far more stylish one, I think we can agree. I just want to point out that ratty back pocket reuse is still in. <laughs>